Perplexity have just dropped Perplexity Labs, and it already feels 10 times more powerful than the already great AI-powered search engine we've been using for the past couple of years. You can research and create assets that would take humans weeks in just a couple of minutes. And so in this video, I'm going to go through Perplexity Labs, its features, and three examples of how you can use it to create dashboards, reports, and even a full business plan and brand in a matter of minutes. So this is the pro area of Perplexity. You have these three buttons down here which is the normal search feature you have deep research which is similar to chat gpt's deep research which gives you you know a really detailed outlook and it researches from multiple sources to create a report for you then you have this new feature which is labs when you click the labs little feature in perplexity it will bring you to this page and you see it's 20 dollars a month to unlock this setting and honestly we've got so used to getting so much power almost for free these days but even 20 dollars a month is so cheap for what perplexity labs offers now um, i'm going to go through a couple prompts here that i've run and show you just what you can expect to create with this stuff um this is the first prompt, and I've got a whole set of them here that I've I've been using and trying out on. But this is a really cool one. This is a brand new channel, I'm putting out content every single day, trying to help people drive more traffic to their websites, build better digital assets. So if you get anything from this video, please hit the subscribe button and comment with your thoughts below. I want to open a ghost kitchen focused on healthy meal prep delivery. Research the most profitable food delivery niches in 2025, analyze the successful ghost kitchen models, and create a business plan, including menu development, pricing strategy, delivery logistics, and scaling to multiple locations with 18 months. So I want to open a food business, for example, and I want basically Perplexity Labs to do all the research and create a plan for me. And as you go through this, you can see it's really impressive what it's built out. So you can see it started off with market analysis and strategic implementation. So we've got this great graph straight from the off of the growth in ghost, ghost kitchen sizes and healthy meal um, market, a lot backed by some data. We've got particular hot topics and trends to do with healthy eating and search trends that are up based on the amount of people searching for these things and the consumerism choices of the newer generations. It goes on and on into this consumer behavior. Then it goes on to the next stage, which is looking at ghost kitchen models and trying to understand what our menu would look like, the technology we need, the strategic location, which is, I guess, the three core elements, the food, the technology, or the equipment to deliver the service and the location of our service. And then it builds out the business plan with how much we're going to need to start up this business and charts all the way through this as well. This is really cool how much it builds out. And then this is really cool. This is where it gets really, really exciting is based on its research. It's even started building out a sample menu for us. And you can see the pricing points, the protein, which was a key feature in healthy eating, even naming the items and giving them different categories and how long it would take to prep them. So we've kind of almost got like the framework of a business already, including the pricing and what we can offer to our customers. And even it goes and then starts looking at expenses and how much it's going to cost to use the delivery platforms. And then what I really like down the bottom is, boom, it's generated a whole business plan in about 10 minutes based off of all this research. Something that I've tried to write business plans in the past can take days, more like weeks to actually go and research this stuff out, get all the research and write it out into a nice business plan. It's done all the work there. And that's before we get on to something next which i asked it to do but i just want to go through the tabs that's a sample report that you might a sort of simple sample report that labs can bring out so you've got these tabs at the top which first one is the labs button which is sort of this report and the different things it's um researched and you can even see its process if you click sources you can see all the different places it's used to resource this information steps you can see how it went about it, it's thinking, why it chose certain things and what it's searching for along the way within those sources and, and how it's building out the assets. And then the really cool part about labs is this assets tab. So you can see all the different things it's created for us here, all the different charts that it's built. You can see some of the menu, for example. So you can go through and just look at the assets it's built. Now from here, I wanted to try and test it a little more. And I then asked it based on this implementation roadmap and the research it's done in the business plan i said based on this research act as a brand strategist and visual designer your mission is to create comprehensive and inspiring mood board for a new brand this mood 
board will serve as a foundational guide for the brand's identity across all platforms. So I'm asking it to go the next step further and start creating a mood board, start sort of pulling together some design ideas for a brand that we could use on this. And I was pretty pleased with what it came out with as well. You can see um, if we go to back to the labs tab, we can sort of see its research as it went through to concept the brand and the colors, the, ki the, the brand colors and the sort of kitchen color palette that it wants to align with. And then even came up with a name and a sort of rough sort of sketch out of the logo, which is pretty, pretty cool. I know I'd quite like the name NutriFlow Kitchen kind of does what what we're looking for healthy meal prep was another concept that it came up with and some even like packaging colors and so you can really start to get a feel for how this business is coming to life even website and apps and content ideas coming through which you can see all in the, the assets here so we've got a really cool start to a business in a matter of minutes now the other prompt i wanted to try on was something was building a dashboard for a business or for a project. And I wanted to do it as act as a content strategist and a data analyst. Your mission is to design a dashboard that helps content creator identify topics, understand audience questions, and find hidden gem video ideas for my niche, which is um, search and SEO and AI content marketing YouTube niche, which is where I wanted it to create me like a content opportunity dashboard, basically. And if we go actually click this, button here this app tab it's actually built out a dashboard app for me i can pick my core topics on the right here so let's say ai we'll go and look at what we're looking at high level of trends we can see these trends of what is trending up which is everything in this niche so probably a good niche to be in we can see the growth in different search terms based off google trends coming in here that what a high volume, high growth. So AI powered SEO tools is going to be a hidden gem topic for me to potentially cover. And actually it's got the hidden gem topic finder down here. So this is a really interactive dashboard as well. It's gone and mined from people also asked. It's gone and mined from Quora. It's gone and mined from Reddit, all these topics that are kind of nicely presented. They don't do much at the moment, but you could continue building out this app to actually be really useful in a content strategist dashboard basically to find these hidden trends and useful things you can see all the assets as well that it's built in here and all the different graphs and keyword trends um which is pretty crazy like that's awesome to be able to build something like that out um in a matter of minutes it's quite basic at the moment but imagine what you could do if you spent some time building this stuff out now and that's perplexity and that's perplexity labs really quickly for you Go and try it out. The only thing I should caveat that with is the pro model comes with, I think it's actually 50 labs queries per month because they're so in-depth. It's not like chatting with ChatGPT where you quickly fire messages back and, back and forward. It's like briefing your research or your strategist to go and provide a report or build a dashboard 